Hey, Avid Armor family. Welcome back. Uh, this is me without a hat on, in case you noticed. <laughs> um, it's actually gardening season here in the heart of the Midwest. Um, so today we're actually gonna be making up a fresh cucumber salad in a mason jar. So we actually have a, an overabundance of cucumbers uh, growing in the garden right now. So we got some fresh cucumbers right here out of the garden. Um, got some fresh jalapenos here out of the garden because we're actually gonna be doing like a sweet heat uh, cucumber salad today. Um, unfortunately, I don't have bell peppers and onions growing in my garden right now. Um, so I went ahead and just picked these up at the store, but I got a uh, red bell pepper here, green bell pepper, and some onion, and some garlic. Um, then we're gonna go ahead, first thing we're gonna do is we're actually gonna make the vinegar mixture first. That's gonna be going into the jar. Um, and then we'll cut up all the fresh vegetables um, and we'll get everything packed together in a jar. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get our vinegar mixture going here. Um, so we're gonna cook it in our pan here. So what I got is a half cup of white vinegar. And one cup of sugar. Half a tablespoon of salt. And we're gonna throw in a half teaspoon of mustard seed. and a half teaspoon of celery seed. All right, now that everything's thrown in there, we're gonna bring this to a boil. Uh, we'll let it cook down for just a little bit, and then we'll actually pull it off and we'll, we're gonna throw it in the fridge and let it cool off for about an hour. Um, and then that, while that's cooling off, we'll get into the veggies and we'll get slicing those up. This is actually getting Pretty close to boiling here already. Ooh, man, that is strong. <laughs> Woo, vinegar burns the nose. Hey. Burn your nose hairs. Hey, come here, okay. Come on, man, get you a big whiff of this. Get you a big whiff of that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now that we got the vinegar mixture uh, in the fridge, it's cooling off. We're gonna go ahead and cut up our fresh vegetables, vegetables, veggies on a table. <laughs> so let's get going, uh, get slicing on it. Um, we're gonna do this with some flair. All right, guys, now that our vinegar mixture is cooled off, all of our fresh veggies are cut. Um, we actually have our um, sterilized mason jar here. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and throw it all together and get it all packaged up in our, in our mason jar. So let's get going on it. So you're gonna wanna pack this stuff down in there real nice, cause actually once you pack everything up, um, it actually shrinks up a lot once it's been sitting in your fridge for a little while. So you can try to pack as much stuff in here as possible. What do you call a slightly open jar? Anybody? No? A jar. <laughs> oh man. Throwing in a couple cloves of garlic too for a little extra flavor. Made a couple jalapenos, just because. Want another one? No, that's it. And <laughs> <laughs> he starts coughing. <laughs> uh. Oh my god, sorry. How you feel about that? Oh, sorry. Sorry, man, I don't mean to be jalapeno business. Wow. <laughs> You gonna live? Yeah, man. <laughs> All right, I think we got this. All right, I think we got this packed about as full as we're gonna get it. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw in the vinegar, uh, vinegar mixture here. Mm. 
Get all this mixture out. All right, guys, now that we got everything uh, packed up in our jar here, um, we're gonna be actually using our USV20 Ultra Series uh, chamber sealer today. Um, and not only is it an awesome chamber sealer in a, in a smaller footprint, so it goes great in any home kitchen um, because it is a smaller size, um, but one of the awesome features about this machine is it has the accessory port. Um, so what we're gonna be doing is actually using that accessory port and that accessory function to vacuum seal our mason jar inside um, one of our um, canisters. So this is actually the biggest canister that comes with the Avid Armor canister set. So um, what I'm gonna do is actually open this up. We'll get our accessory hose attached to the accessory port here on the inside of the chamber. And then I'll go ahead and just attach this to the top of the canister as well. All right. And then, so we'll go ahead and just take the lid off for now and set it off to the side. We're gonna throw our mason jar inside the canister um, and you want to keep you know this is on but you want to keep the lid loose um, don't don't tighten it down that way it can vacuum the air out of the jar all right and then we're going to go ahead and throw the canister lid on and then what we're going to do is press and hold down the auto vac and seal button for two seconds and it'll kick in the accessory port um, to start vacuuming the air out of the canister and the mason jar. Um, and before you do that too, um, just make sure to the top of your canister, um, there is a section on there that says seal and a section for opening it. Um, just make sure it is turned to the seal portion um, so you, you are sealing your canister. If you happen to accidentally leave it in the open position, you won't be sucking any air out of your canister. So make sure that's turned to seal. And then we're gonna go ahead and press and hold down our auto vac and seal button. All right, let's see if that worked. All right, got a nice seal on our mason jar. Nice and sealed. So you can go ahead and after that's finished, tighten the lid all the way down, throw this in the refrigerator, um, use it whenever you want, whenever you're ready to eat it, but you can throw it in the refrigerator and you can keep it up to up to about two months um, since it's, it's sealed up and all the air is taken out of it. Um, and as long as you keep it in the fridge, it should be good up to two months. So you got a beautiful cucumber salad ready to go. That's it for today, guys. Again, thanks for watching. If you like what you're seeing, press that like and subscribe button, and we'll be back for some more fun uh, coming up soon. Thanks, guys.